Hey there, gamer guys and gals. We haven't I haven't done a video with myself in it in a while, and I want to do a boxing. There's some, some, some more box unboxings coming too as well. But uh, excuse me, I've been trying to hit the gym a lot more and stuff. So I haven't been gaming and I haven't been doing as many reviews and stuff as usual. But I'm still doing it. So thank you to the guys that watch them and you know, and support the channel. I appreciate it. Still endorsed by Ma. Link on the homepage of my YouTube if you want to, uh, you know, try a good energy drink. But uh, today we're doing an unboxing from East Starland. I did one before with NES games. Uh, this one's going to be Atari 2600 games. Because if you didn't know, there's a new Atari. Well, a remake of the Atari 2600 coming out in November. It's the Atari 2600 Plus. And I'll definitely do an unboxing of that because I already have mine pre-ordered. I ordered Berserk and um, the paddles as well. So I'll be able to unbox all that for you. And as soon as it gets here, I'll have a video up. But this is just some games that I grabbed. Got a lot of games and I spent probably 80 bucks. They they do a really good job. Their games are always real nice and clean looking. Um, they're always shipped really, really well as you can see. Tons of padding. Uh, they're pretty inexpensive as well. Pretty good deals. Some games, they're going to be a lot more because some of these games are collector's items. and uh, But they're fair. So let's go ahead and get into it now. Right off the back, we got Atlantis. And you see they wrap them in plastic. Look at that. That looks brand new. If it was the 1970s, that's what that looks like. We were back in the 70s and we wanted to... Uh, Play some 2600 games. You can't get no better looking than that. Look at that. That's beautiful. That is a really clean looking game. I have no doubt that's going to work. Next we have Cosmic Arc. Look at that. Look how good that looks. Wrapped in plastic. Kept dust out of it. Once again, no question this is going to work. But if it didn't, I'd have no issue getting another one. They're, they're a great company to order retro games from. Next we have Pac-Man. Look at that. You don't see a Pac-Man looking that brand new. So that's like, that looks like if uh, you know if they had to put new stickers and stuff on it. Looks like a brand new game. Look at that. How clean, how clean and how good that label looks. Amazing. Couldn't be happier so far. One of my favorite games of all time. Looks brand new again. Yars Revenge. Look at that. You can't ask for better shape than that. Like you order some stuff on eBay, it'll say like like new, and you'll get it, and you're like, man, this this looks horrible. This stuff, it, it always is what it says it's going to be. Like new, look at that bowling. Look at that perfect labels, not a single label issue. Wrapped in plastic, nice and clean. Missile command. Now yeah, look at that beautiful. Look at that. It's perfection. It looks like it's like we're back in 77. Well, no, I wouldn't have been around because I was not that old. But Atari 2600 Miss Pac-Man. Look at that. It was like a brand new game. I can't test these because I don't have a 2600 yet. I just ordered that one from Atari. Demon Attack. Like I said, it was like a brand new game. Mint condition. If you collect games, this is how you want them to look when you get here. One of the first games i ever seen in my life. Frogger, look at that. Love it. Love the song. Love the game. I can play this for hours. This, this, is, one of the, this is one of the ones that started my love for gaming right here. Next we got Space Invaders. Look at that mint. Mint. If y'all ain't ordering your games from East Starland, you're, you're missing out. You're missing out. Galaxian. That new Atari is going to pay 7,800 games too. So I'm going to have to get Galaga. That was one of my favorites. But this is sort of like the Atari version. Well, the 2600 version, not the Atari. They're both Atari. Mousetrap looks a little bit rough. 
but that's the only game that doesn't look great. But still, everything else looks good. It's just that one little spot there. Not a, not, not a major deal. Not a major deal. One out of how many we've opened so far. An asteroid. There we go. We're back to mint looking, brand new looking games. Donkey Kong, a little, little rough in some spots. Seems like these uh, Coleco style games, like the labels, are kind of wore out. Probably because people played them so much. They were they were really fun games. Cause I got a Smurfs one that looks kind of rough like this. I didn't get from them, but seems like uh, those games, the labels, you know, they might not look as good. This one, same with these Activision. This one looks a little rough, but it's still great looking. Kaboom! You're not going to find much better than that. I love this game. I can play this. I can play this for hours. Me and my buddy used to play the hell out of this game. Pitfall looks a little bit old, but I'll, I'll take it. It's not that bad. It looks a little rough, but this is one that was cheap anyway, and this is one that you know, if I'm not happy with this copy, I can pass it on to somebody. And I can find these all over the place. This game isn't rare at all. It's and it's a classic. Love this game. Barnstorming. Another good looking copy. Defender. Look at that. It looks brand new. Got a few more here. Actually, two more here. Cubert. Looks great. Let me know in the comments what was your favorite 2600 game. Here's one I loved as well. Crystal Castles. I got Popeye coming, Smurfs. That's a couple more of my favorites. One game I probably never get, and it was my favorite though, was Hero. But God, the price is so crazy. I just don't see myself paying that much for an old 2600 game. I'd love to find it though. Hero and uh, Root Beer Tapper. That's two games I haven't been able to find at a decent price because they're really high. But yeah, that's East Starland, you know. Great looking game. So if you're looking for 2600, PlayStation, uh, NES, Super NES, they have tons and tons of games at decent prices and in great shape. So uh, check them out. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for the support. Please like and comment and subscribe. All that good stuff that you know helps us uh, keep getting good games. You know, I uh, appreciate you. And until next time, see you in those leaderboards.